think it's been a great season. Um, coming into the season, I, I understood that we, we had a young team, um, and it's a large team, but it's it's large. It's by and large a, a young team, and and as a result of that, I, I expected that the season was going to be uh, sort of full of surprises. So uh, that's thus far has kind of has been full of surprises. You know, we we were able to. Uh, take second place in the regular season conference races. Uh, we were able to take second place uh, at the conference championship. Uh, so in both cases, I was really satisfied with how our guys competed. And I'm really excited about the development that I've seen over the course of the season. Um, and again, I think it really bodes well for the future of the program. Uh, both our sophomore and our junior class have 20 plus uh, runners in them. And I think uh, they're really going to be sort of the very foundation of a, of a great team next year. So really pleased with what's going on so far. Our uh, favorite part of the season has been our race where we did an overnight trip up to Carlisle, Pennsylvania. Uh, gave us a really unique opportunity to run through water hazards, which is not something that usually anyone faces. So as though we, although we couldn't have run as fast as we wanted to, it still gave us a really unique opportunity. And it was kind of fun. Uh, going into our championship meet, I feel pretty confident that our team overall could perform really well. We hope for a top three placement. Um, I feel like our varsity squad has shown really strong improvement over the season, and I think that we could really go out there and compete. Uh, my goals for the meet are to break 1630. I feel like I should be able to. I put in the hard work over these past weeks. I mean, and uh, our goal for the team is to get top three. I think we should be able to do it. Freshmen are looking good too. When JV uh, for me individually, I want to run 15.45, 15.30, somewhere around there for the 5K. And then as a team, I would love to get top three. I think we can get first if we all really put in a top performance, but top three would be great as well anywhere in there. And, uh, you know, so going into this race uh, individually, I, I'm certainly excited for a lot of our individual runners uh, to really break through, whether it be a 24-minute guy breaking through or a 20-minute guy breaking through or uh, a 17-minute guy breaking through. Uh, collectively, you know, the county championship is, is, has often, has always traditionally been a day when our guys run their fastest. Uh, it's less of a cross-country race and a little bit more like a road race. So as, you know, because you're running on asphalt, times tend to be a little bit quicker. And uh, so the guys are always very excited about running at Brookdale. We've been over there already twice to practice on the course. And I, I, as a team, I really think that all three levels, our, our freshmen, our JV, and our varsity are all likely to, to finish in, you know, you have a very strong chance of finishing in the top three.